Hey guys, this is Seven Three Two One Eight, and uh, today I'm I'm kind of do, doing a blog kind of sort of video. I'm just wanna I've not really done like proper blogs like named as blogs, but I think I might do this one as a blog. Um, I've got a a few stuff to uh to talk about and all that. Um, well, um, I completed Alan Wake about a couple of days ago. Fantastic game. I would really recommend Alan Wake, which is here. I got the DLC as well, but it came with the DLC, with the first one of course. Um, excellent game, I really enjoyed this game a lot. I'll probably go back and play it on the hardest setting probably, cause it's, a, it's, a absolutely, it's a brilliant game to get. Fully recommend it, it's a good game. Um, probably one of the best exclusives I've played for the Xbox, uh, for, this, for this year. I wasn't going to say for all time, because you, you, all you Xbox fanboys will go mad at me. <laughs> but, yeah. Um... Yeah, I've got um, I've got thoughts on uh, what console. Right, do, I'm going to be getting another new console, guys. It's um, it's a console I've had before two times actually. Um, I'm going to be getting another PlayStation Three just for two 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 main reasons. Right, I'm only going to be getting it for exclusives. So, like say like um, Call of Duty, I'll be getting on the Xbox, and um, like Star Wars Force Unleashed two. Them sort of games that come out this year, New Pursuit, Pursuit Force, uh, Pursuit. Them games will be on the Xbox, of course. I always get my games exclusive for the Xbox. Um, but I'm going to be get. There's a lot of good games, to be honest. Um, and I, I, I was speaking to a Scottish film fan on the Xbox, and a good chat, and we were chatting for a couple hours. We were discussing all about this as well. I mean, I'm not a fanboy. I, I don't, I don't. Well, personally, I like the Xbox 360 better, but I'm not like a oh PC shit and all that kind of crap. I mean, the PSC is very good for graphics, I'll give it that. They've got good exclusives. I mean, they've got... This year, they've got Grand Turismo 5, which I, I, I love them games so much on the on the, X, on the PS3, on the PS2 and PS1, sorry. And it's coming out on the PSC in November. I really want to get it. I don't know if you know, but there's a, there's a couple of editions. There's one called a Signature Edition, which is only available in Europe and Australia, That as far as I know. It comes a, a couple more stuff more than the actual US edition they get. Um, but yeah, I'm going to be getting the uh, Grand Turismo 5 definitely when I get a PS3 and there's other games like the new Motorstorm, new Resistance, there's loads of new stuff coming out, I mean, and the second reason is, I'm going to be upgrading my Blu-ray player which is down there at the moment, I'm going to be upgrading it, um, because I was looking into other Blu-ray players, there's one I was wanting the most was this one, it cost 180 quid, but a few people told me that PS3, it's probably the best option to get because one, it's got Wi-Fi in it, so there's a Blu-ray player in it, so you can get the updates and all that, and it's all up to date. But if you went and got, say, you want to put a player with Wi-Fi in it, but you need to buy a dongle or something, I've seen it, and you can probably get it in one on eBay or Amazon or whatever. But I, but I want to get these exclusives as well, so why don't I just pick up a PSD again? And I don't really find anything wrong with a PSD. But um, yeah, if I get when I get a PSC, probably it may be next week. I might get it. You never know. It'll be next two weeks or a week or so or say, so, I'll be getting it. Um, I'll be getting a new PS3, and solely it will be used for exclusives and Blu-ray player, Blu-ray player mostly. So, and uh, so everybody, I don't know. I had an old profile on the PS3, but I might make a new one. I'll see if I can up if I can get it back. But I think I will make a new one. But when I get at time, I'll probably do an unboxing. It'll be a slim model, probably a two fifty gigabyte, probably one hundred twenty gig actually, because I don't really need it. But today there's been announced that there's a hundred sixty gigabyte and three hundred twenty gigabyte new PlayStation Three models that'll be out this year. So that probably just because moves coming out and all that sort of. T I'm not really again. I'm not really into the new motion sensor thing because I think this controller is the best way for playing games. I mean. Okay, we're family and all that. Yeah, connect and all that would be kind of fun, but nah, not for by yourself. Controllers are the best way to play games like Halo Reach, Gears of War, you know them sort of games. So yeah, I'm going to be getting a new PSC guys soon, and um, <clears throat> yeah, I can't wait to get it again. I've been, mean, I've not really missed it that much because the Xbox, why I think online's better, and I play online on the uh, mostly when I play games. So uh, yeah, so I'll be getting that in the next couple, uh, next one to one to two weeks, I'd say roughly. Uh, and that main leaves the main option. I do not know t what to do with my Blu-ray player, which is down there. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna, I might sell it, but I'll, I'll see what happens. I mean, I, I don't need it really. So when I get a PS, when I get a PS, I don't need it. But I might do this for a crazy giveaway. I might be giving away a Blu-ray player. 
but I need a thousand. I will do that if I get a thousand subscribers. But if it doesn't come within the next, I would doubt it would come in the next two months at least. I I don't think I'll get a thousand subscribers in the next two months. But if I do, I will do a giveaway for all of my subscribers to enter into a competition for a Blu-ray player, which would be fantastic for a lot of people. So if you're interested in that, leave a comment in the bottom or what you think about it. So, and um, yeah, that's that. Um, not really much else to talk about games. There's been some good trailers that I've been watching for Star Wars Force Unleashed 2, um, Mortstorm, the new one, the Apocalypse is called, Grand Turismo 5. Uh, I've seen a couple. I can't wait for Halo Reach now. I'm really looking forward to that. Um, what else could I show you? Um, I've been recently. I've been watching this film. Again, I was speaking about Scottish film. About this film. This is film is very good. Of Blu-ray, it's, it's a creepy film. It's really good, but it's a brilliant film on Blu-ray. The Wolf Creek. Wolf Creek. Um, I've got this idea of actually doing. Um, let's put that back in there. I've actually got an idea of of uh, like doing a a Blu-ray of the month or Blu-ray of the week video. It's just something I want to start because everybody does like these sort of things, but I've thought of something like like Blu-ray of the week, I'll pick a Blu-ray that I bought or something and then just like tell it and all that. So um I'll probably do that. It's just an idea I'm thinking of at the moment, so but that's a good idea. Uh I just want to give a congratulations as well to uh, a, a YouTuber called Samantha the Less. Uh, she just hit a thousand subscribers. Uh, well done to her. Really good, um, and uh, just shows the community is getting better for films and all that. So, but as you see there, I've got like six shelves of Blu-rays. I really will be needing to upgrade in a new storage, and I have been looking at new TVs as well. Uh, I've got an eye on a thirty-two inch new Sony TV, which is about five hundred quid or something. So yeah, that'll be good for the new PSC. So that might have to wait on TV, but the PSC will be the first thing to come. So yeah, guys. But yeah, that's just a little, a little blog, a little update on what's happening and what stuff's going to be coming soon. Next week, there will be more Blu-rays, <laughs> promise you that. There's going to be loads, quite a lot, because, well, if you live in the UK if, and if you work, it's a pay, payday. So, yay, money. So, um, I've got quite a few, uh, bl quite a lot of Blu-rays I've been after. And again, end of the month, well, actually next week, there's Hot Tub Machine. That looks pretty interesting. It looks funny. I, lo I love comedy films. There's been a lot of com the comedy sections like here. I like a lot of comedy films. Um, well, there's Kick Ass that comes out in September. Robin Hood: The Limited Steelbook Edition that comes out in September. There's a couple more coming. Uh, Prince of Persia comes out in September. And some people have been asking me, are, are am I getting the new Aliens, uh, anthology, anthology? I think it is called uh, on Blu-ray. Yes, I am getting it. But I'm well deciding whether to just get the normal box set, which the artwork looks bloody amazing on the front with that alien, or the collector's edition of a big, huge alien egg with um, an alien wrapped around it. So I'm really tempted to get that too. But the box, the box art looks so cool in the in the Blu-ray one. I, I'm going to make a tough decision getting it. All I know is that alien egg is available in HGV and Play.com if you want to go and look at it. So. um but yeah guys, that's my little blog update. Uh, thanks for watching guys, and also thanks for subscribing. And uh, I will see you in the next vid. Any comments, leave it, uh, leave it below, and I'll see you in the next vid guys. See ya.